Well, I didn't make it three days in a row, but we are back on Monday. What is it, the 29th? Seems to be a magic Monday for the Olympics. Great Britain doing pretty well. But here we go. We're on an Icelandic pale beer. Got to thank my friends at Iceland Air. They bought these to a golf day I attended. So what we've got here is what they sell on the flight, I think. It's like a Viking there called Einstock. And it's called an Icelandic Arctic Pale Ale. It's 5.4%. A bit of a dull can. But let's not judge the uh, beer by the cover. Get rid of that while I pour. So let's see what this is all about. So I think they sell this on the aircraft. Oh, nice carbonation there. Oh, spillage. Um, first thoughts, the colours are fabulous actually, quite orange, darker than the, it's quite dark for a pale actually, it's more like a, a West Coast IPA, but look at that, good carbonation there, hmm, smells more like a, a Pilsner and a lager type, um, but let's have a look, so you got the, uh, like a, a bittery hoppiness. So this I might actually be better than what I thought. I thought it looked a bit, uh, a little bit dull in the can. But let's have a look. Let's get it down our esophagus. Um, that's actually very good. Um, yeah, you get a bit of, a bit of citrus there, but really it's the the bitterness and the hops so it's uh, that comes through really the arctic pale ale i don't know if that's like a, a cold ipa which are my favorite types of ipas to be fair um but that's decent uh for einstock i reckon that's 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 on a par with uh, anything brewdog produces so that's a good seven and a half out of ten for me Bottom up, cheers, and let's uh, cheer on Team Big GB to more goals in the swimming tonight. Au revoir.